I have a challenge. Can you beat George? Who has the gramba to defeat the CEO and founder of Freedom? Well, apparently no one in the MGM3 guild in Elvenar. If you take a look here, I am currently the number one player in this guild of 25 Freedom Partners. And I'm wondering, how come that is? Can you beat me? So, what is this game? We had to create six guilds, <laughs> six guilds, because so many of you wanted to play this game with me that I am now the guild master of six guilds in Elvenar. Now, I'm not number one in every of the six guilds, but I'm trying to be because I want to see how the Freedom Family can help each other grow together. And here is how. If you look at the chat in all of these Elvenar games, let me hide myself. Whoops, I hid the wrong thing. You are helping each other by subscribing to each other's channels. You're chatting about what kind of games you play. In this, play, in this case, someone is playing Neverwinter and he said it's a 10 out of 10. So it helps you discover new games. And the chat is just very popular. There's a lot of comments, a lot of suggestions. So get into the game. And even if you don't really play the game, get into the chat to talk to other Freedom Partners. Also, the game has an in the game has a mail system and some of you have been sending me messages like Zephyr315 who said these are all of my ideas so far about the freedom game did you know we're asking you for ideas about what game should we make so that we can all play together as a family if not click that I up there in the top right corner that'll take you to the video where you are where we are asking you to give us feedback on your ideas for what game we should make so this has an in-game messaging system where you can send people direct messages and this is where you can also um, give people feedback on each other's channels. You can uh, compose a message and say, hey, I saw a great uh, video by you. Uh, here's my feedback. So Elvenar as well, here is a pro tip. You see all these little blinky, uh, let me move myself again. You see all these little blinky uh, resources. If you click one and drag, I'm dragging my mouse button, it gets everything without having to click individually one by one. That's a pro tip. Another pro tip is if you're starting to see the invisibility bug, let's say you go into combat, I'll pick one at random here, and I'll go fight something, and I'm just going to uh, do this as a demo. And you notice some things are invisible. One of my characters is invisible. So the way to solve that is just refresh the browser. When you refresh the browser, all of these little bugs like invisibility go away. So if you're playing this game, those are two pro tips. Do you have any more pro tips about Elvenar? Click some links, click the link down, or click link. <laughs> Tell me down there in the comments below. Ah, so we are still in combat. Um, so I can continue the combat. Oh, here's a third pro tip. Another pro tip is if you don't like what's going on, you can retreat here and you lose no troops. So I'm going to retreat. Yes. And you see, no loss of troops. So don't hesitate to retreat if you think it's going to go badly or it is going badly because it takes a long time to replenish your troops. All right. So for those of you who haven't joined yet, look for the guild which has available spots. You do that by search, by clicking this little button here and then search for the fellowship MGN. That will tell you which of these, you can see th three of them are full here. So this is the latest one I've created, the fourth one. We actually have two other MGN guilds on server one. Some of you didn't listen to instructions and started playing on server one. So there's over like 40 of you now on server one. So I have two more guilds on server one. But this is server four. It's important that you join us on server four because this is the lowest population server. So there's um, less people to pass on our road to number one on the server. Now, of course, if you've already put in a lot of time on server one just keep playing there because there's gonna be a lot more of you who will start playing the game on server one a part of the problem is when you create a new account you don't get to choose which server you will play on it automatically throws you into server one so you need to after the tutorial ends exit and go back 
to play the game and choose Kalinar. Kalinar is server 4. And you know you're on server 4 if it says US4. That's the key. And then apply to join the MGN guild by simply searching for MGN and then clicking... Uh, whoop. That's, there's no players called MGN, that's good. <laughs> Searching for the MGN Fellowship, <clears throat> and then click View Fellowship. Do not click Send a Message, because if you click Send a Message, that's not going to let us invite you. But if you click View Fellowship, then you'll get an Apply button down here. I don't see one because I'm the Guild Master. I can't apply to my own guild. But you will see an Apply button. That's how you join the MGN Guild. Then again, as soon as we fill out MGN 4, there will be an MGN 5 and so on. As long as you keep playing this game, we will keep supporting you by giving you a guild to chat, help each other grow together, and have fun. Okay. How are you guys liking Elvenar? Tell me in the comments below. And who am I? I am George, CEO and founder of Freedom. And you've been watching and we will grow together as a family because this is the Freedom Family. You are part of it, we are all part of it, and we're all growing together. So grow with us and partner with Freedom. That Play Now button right there on the video bar is all you need to click to get started.